Terminator. The Lin Kuei will banish you. Your clan cannot terminate me. Wishful thinking machine. Round one, fight! Even Terminators can be destroyed. Your maker has failed you. Round one, fight.
Round two, fight! Both constructs built to serve. You are also a Terminator? When my creator requires it. Round one. Fight! be back. The Terminator wins.
Lin Kuei. Stupid machine. Round one. Fight! to be leave or be terminated not to be round one fight
Get over here! Resistance is futile. Final round. Fight! Does Legion have a collector? It only needs Terminators. All sovereigns need tribute. Round one, fight! Thank <laughs> you. 
Are you of concern to Outworld? Does it contain sentient humanoid life? I'll take that as yes. Round one, fight! I have been expecting you. Your life, your name, they will be wiped from history. Come, it is time to die. Round one, fight! It was an epic accident that brought the Terminator here, rather than to his own Earth's past. 
but it didn't take long for him to adapt. He figured that terminating Kronika and taking her hourglass gave him the best chance at achieving his mission objective. Destroying humanity so that the machines prevail. Turns out the hourglass wasn't the ultimate weapon. No matter how many times the Terminator rebooted history, the war between humans and the machines always ended the same, with their mutual destruction. He realized this war was a losing game. The only way to win was not to play. So the Terminator used the hourglass to build a future where machines and humans don't fight. They cooperate. The Terminator knew that to preserve this future, no one else could learn about the Hourglass. The information stored in his machine mind was dangerous. It had to be eliminated. That's why the Terminator threw himself into the infinite depths of the Sea of Blood. No one would ever find him, or unlock the Hourglass's secrets. If you could ask him about it, he'd tell you he made the only logical choice. But in my book, that machine's a hero.